Meanwhile, in the latest developments on Donald Trump's criminal cases, a judge in Atlanta, Georgia, has set bail for the former United States president at $200,000. Fulton County Superior Court Judge Scott McAfee approved the bond agreement on Monday in relation to District Attorney Fannie Willis' election interference case on Trump. The bond agreement sets out strict rules for Trump's behavior in the lead up to the trial. This includes making no direct or indirect threat of any nature against any co-defendant. Moreover, Trump cannot communicate with any witness or co-defendant about the facts of the case except through his legal counsel. This involves not only in-person dealings but also posts or reposts on social media. Trump agrees to the $200,000 bond and says, and says in a social media post that he plans to turn himself in on Thursday to face election interference charges, but added that this is in quote, end quote, strict coordination with President Joe Biden's Department of Justice and alleges election interference. In addition to Trump, Fulton County Superior Court, or Court Judge Scott McAfee also set bonds on Monday for attorneys John Eastman and Kenneth Chisbro at $100,000, for Ray Smith III at $50,000, and for Scott Hall at $10,000.